The art of layering is one of those areas of fashion that we have probably all experimented with. Coined as the way to look like you haven't tried, even though you have, it can be a tricky one to master. But with autumn winter just around the corner, now is the perfect time to master layering for your own style and to get your hands on those key pieces to enable you to achieve this look with no fuss. The layering look isn't about bulk or just adding as many layers as possible, but instead about the cut of the pieces that you are choosing and how they all come together to create the right effect within the outfit. So ladies, let's get ready for autumn together and start layering. So ladies, we're talking layering here. And layering is one of those areas of fashion that can take on different forms depending on your personal style and depending on your body shape. But I often find that there are two reasons for creating that layering look. Either because you're actually wanting to camouflage a certain area of your silhouette or because you actually like that look of lots of draping fabrics and different lengths going on. So this outfit is all about helping you to find those key pieces that will create the layering style, as I say, without adding bulk and things like that. So what we're going to start with here is our top. And this is really, really fab because when I was choosing this outfit, there were a few different brands that I could have chosen to create the layering style. But I went with this one from Laurie Goldstein because she knows how to pick pieces that work with so many other bits in our wardrobe. So this top, I'm just going to take this to the side a little bit so you can see the detail. So as you can see, it's got a lovely drape to it, falls into almost a handkerchief hemline at the sides, and then you've got these really fun little pockets. So that extra layer, that extra touch of detail, just makes it kind of you know a little bit different and it just hangs in the right way so this is such a wardrobe hero because you could team this up with anything I've done a black because it's so so useful and I think this looks really sharp with the rest of the outfit Laurie is a editor at American Nail, so she knows her stuff and the cut is always fantastic now when it comes to the jeans I think for this layering look because we're doing a dress down casual type of style I think this light blue always works so so well it looks casual Casual, it looks relaxed, but in a Diane Gilman skinny, it looks so fantastic on the body shape. So you may have a pair of Diane Gilman, you may not. If you haven't tried this brand, I would definitely check it out because, as I say, they're really lovely and flattering into the waistline. Now, let's talk about the boots because I... I'm obsessed with these boots, I really, really am. They are from Clark's, but they look so designer. These have been all over the catwalk, so it's so nice to have them here at QVC. So they're full leather, and as you can see, they just nip over the top of Tiffany's knee, so they create that, you know, a little bit of an edgy look, it's fab. Um, and I think, when we're talking layering, a knee-high boot is really the only way to go because the way that they fold over a skinny jean, it creates that different length and that different layer. Now, you've got to be careful with the jeans for the knee-high boots. Always make sure you are going to skinny because otherwise, if you have a boot cut or straight, they tend to bunch up. Up, up towards the knee and it just doesn't look quite right so always go for a skinny now we are going to talk about our duster from Chelsea Muse when I was thinking about the final touch to the layering look obviously there's lots of cardigans around things like that but a duster just looks a bit more contemporary and this one has such a fantastic length because it's really dramatic you've got the side splits up the side of the hemline which just opens it out and it falls nicely on the silhouette and in this strong monochrome palette, it looks so striking. Now, for one of our final pieces, I'm going to add a scarf to Tiffany. Now, I would say a scarf is one of your hero pieces for the layering look because you can literally throw it on and it just creates a nice ruched effect. Obviously, you can wrap it round if you want to feel a little bit more, you know, tucked up, but I'm just going to edge it across the, the um, sides of the duster. This one has this beautiful sequin detail, which just adds a bit of character to the whole outfit and it just feels a bit more exciting. So as you can see, we're adding different dimensions, different, di um, different layers, and it's all just coming together really nicely. And then I'm going to add this necklace. So this is going to be really key for this top because it's actually quite a bland palette of black at the moment with no jewellery. So the long silver chain just falls into the middle. And as you can see, the brightness of that silver really brings it to life. And it just draws the eye inwards and downwards, so it's incredibly flattering. Then I'm going to add matching little bracelet. I'm going to pop that on this arm. 
This is the nice thing with ruching up the sleeves is you open it out for a lovely bit of jewellery and that silver coordinates with the necklace. And all that's left to add now is our handbag, which is one of the most exciting parts, which is over here. So for the handbag, I didn't want to do black because we've got so much black going on in the outfit. So I have chosen a really fab charcoal grey. So it's in the same family in that it's a neutral, but the contrast against this monochrome palette stands out so, so beautifully. And this is great because you've got the over the shoulder strap, you can pop it in the crook of your arm, so you can wear it in two ways. But this as a day wear look is so fab. And it's easy, that's what I love about it. You know, you've combined lots of different wardrobe basics, wardrobe heroes, but it's all come together in a really cool way. And she just looks absolutely knockout. This is one of my favourite looks for the season. So this is how to achieve your gorgeous layering look.